To create an angle bisector using patty paper, we need to first start with an angle. Fold your patty paper so that it forms an X. When you have your X, you see that there is possibly one, two, three, four angles. I'm going to select this angle and I'm going to trace that. Since there are more than one angles on this piece of patty paper, I am going to name my angle using three points. Let's call them P, Q, R. To create the angle bisector, I need to fold the patty paper so that ray QP overlaps ray QR and the crease goes to, through vertex Q. So the rays are overlapping each other here. The vertex is along the crease. Opening my patty paper up, mark your crease. Name that line M. Line M is the angle bisector of angle PQR. Indicate that using arcs and tick marks. Please note that angle bisectors can be lines, rays, or segments.